Hey YouTube, welcome back to TCT and the Crazy Troll Nation of YouTube. I just finished um, my Peter Thomas Roth skincare stuff, and so I'm just going to jump right into this video. And I will try to upload them um, simultaneously and not a week apart. Um, I'm probably lying. <laughs> Bare face, I, I used a steamer, excuse me. And then I was reaching for it. <laughs> and then I put on, you know, my serums and creams and everything. So this is me bare face, no makeup. And yes, I have issues and things. And I did point them all out in the other video. So I'm not gonna do that again for this one. But that video was about um, Peter Thomas Rolf. This video is primarily gonna be about Dr. Dennis Gross, his products. Um, a friend of mine who renewed <sighs> my skincare journey passion you know who you are um, she sent me a link that um, dr. Dennis Bruce was having master classes on skincare one was skincare 101 one was on you know anti-aging and stress relief for your skin and another one was something else and so and they were free to sign up it was a webinar and so I did that and I look like my camera's crooked we're just going to be crooked because <laughs> we do that on the crazy troll nation of YouTube. Um, so I did all of that and they had a code for 20% off. So I'm like, okay, that's great. What irritated me was like the next week they had more seminars and they were doing 15% off. And I'm just like, and so I posted a question because they, they had a Q and A column for the chat. And I put, why only 15% off this week when last week the webinars, we had a 25% code. They didn't answer that question. <laughs> Yeah, so I was like, you know what? I'll wait till the Sephora sale and get 20% off instead of using that coupon. But I did use that 20% off and bought a few things. So the one thing I did not purchase because I just could not wrap my head around spending $149 for their facial steamer, only because I had purchased a bunch of skincare already and I know I was gonna purchase more during the sale, which I did. And then QVC had a good, um, good sales and good prices on things and then I went on the Olay site and purchased so I'm like you know I, I just I was having a hard time with spending $149 for a steamer so this one I got from Amazon no this is not one of his products this is Lenovo it looks exactly like his except I think his is pink or something orange I think it's orange like this part is orange but it looks exactly the same and also why I was hesitant um, to purchase his was some of the reviews were saying the water nozzle this part you unscrew take it off put water in screw it on and then you put it back in they were saying it broke after like a couple uses and I'm just like I don't want to spend 150 bucks for something then it break and then I have to send it back and then order another one the same problem happens blah 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 so this one I purchased from Amazon no this video is not sponsored none of mine are my channel so tiny nobody knows who i am except you guys and i love you thank you for being here <laughs> this i believe was like 41 bucks um uh, no 42 or like 45 dollars or something and i you know you run it through the cycle and everything a few times and then use it and i used it tonight and then i put on my skincare so that's what i did tonight so but what um from the, Den the dr dennis gross webinar um, they send you an email. Thank you for being here. Blah, 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 blah. And here's a link if you want to have a virtual consultation. And so, which was free. So I did the virtual con consultation and I'm going to say this, even though it's probably not nice to say it. Um, she asked me what products I was using. And I told her I had tried, um, some of Peter Thomas Roth stuff. And she's like, oh, well, you know, he comes from a family of jewelry makers and he's a jewelry maker. And so I thought that was kind of like a pot shot. Like, so what if he makes products that work for people? What's the difference? And so I told her, and I took it back in the bathroom. I should have kept it here. His um, potent vitamin C um, firm and brighten moisturizer. I said, well, on his containers, it tells you the percentages of whatever the active ingredient is or the, or the ingredient that they're promoting. And I had it in front of me because I said, well, let me go get my caboodle and show you what I'm using. And I'm like, it has 10% vitamin C. It has this, it has that, it has tumor again. And she's like, oh, really? And I'm like, yeah. So she looks up on her screen. She's like, oh, yeah, it does. I said, yeah, I know it does. I told you it did. I knew it did because I read the ingredients. So I was kind of just like annoyed that she was clowning another product. I understand she works for Dr. Dennis Gross. I understand she's a licensed esthetician. I understand that Peter Thomas Roth is not even a doctor. And years ago, he decided to jump into skincare. 
if it works, it works. And so that was annoying to me. <laughs> and <laughs> for Peter Thomas's Roth, his 24 karat gold mask, it does have one there on Sephora. If you, if you read the, you know, more about this product or something, it does say that he was, you know, making jewelry and he noticed from working with gold, his hands were soft and smooth and that's what prompted him to make the gold mask. So I'm like, it's not a secret. And, but anyway, so that was annoying to me. So, but this is not about Peter Thomas Roth. It's about, I'm going to just call him Dennis because just saying Dr. Dennis grows too much. is just too long. So I looked at the list and I thought, is this even the list for me? I thought it was someone else's because the products that she listed, some of them were not the ones that she told me in a video. And one of the items in particular she mentioned was not even on the list. And so I was thinking maybe she got confused. I don't know. Or she was thrown off because... I clowned her for clowning somebody else's product line. Anyway, um, I'm going to go back to her clowning. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, I'm not. I, I have been using Olay since I was in my 20s. And as my skin changes, I would just change to a different line. Okay. You guys, go on the Olay.com website. They have products with vitamin B, vitamin C. Look at this retinol and a retinol cream. Um, they have like whatever issue you have or skincare concern you have, they have products for that on Olay. And I didn't even know that until I went on their website. And so, yeah, I purchased a bunch of stuff. And <laughs> where is it? One item my skin did not like was the Tone Perfection Serum. And this has vitamin B3 and vitamin C in it. My skin did not like that one. Um, but there are other serums my skin really likes this one i've been using for years the olay regenerous serum fragrance free and i will list below what vitamins are in here because i didn't realize this had so much good stuff in it and so i, I am continuing to use this depending on what other products i'm using because i am rotating through different skincare products depending on if it's day if it's night how my skin is feeling what my skin needs back to the consultation <laughs> She recommended the Alpha Beta Pill. They have one for sensitive skin. This is the Universal, which is for if you have like normal or combo skin. And then they have an extra strength, which is, I forget what that one is for. And so I did not want to jump into purchasing the full size ones because they are expensive. This one has five treatments in it. It's a two-step treatment. Um, Hiram, Skincare by Hiram did a review on these. You put one on... And they're labeled step one, and then you wait two minutes, and then you put on step two. And they're in a wipe, so you just wipe them on, on your face and on your neck. Um, she recommended that I alternate, use the universal one night, use the extra strength the next night, use the universal another night, da da da. However, my skin can only tolerate the universal one like every other night. And so I'm not even ordering the extra strength, except I ordered... <laughs> A five treatment kit just to see if that's something I could just use like once a week maybe in place of this one I did order um, the 88 treat but no it was $88 and I think it was I'll put prices below because I don't want to lie to you or I'll put something you know down here because um, they have this one that's a tester so it's five treatments and then they have one that's like 17 treatments and then there's one with 30 treatments and I think that's the one. I don't. I'm not, I don't want to lie to you. I forget how much it is. Um, and then they have a limited edition where you get a thirty plus five, so you get thirty five treatments. I think that's the one that's eighty eight dollars. And I did order that one. So this I will just use every other night, except on nights when I use a Peter Thomas Roth mask that I talked about in the previous video that I will make sure to upload before this one. So this, I, my skin was able to tolerate. Another thing she um, recommended was, which wasn't on the recommendation list, was the Ferolic Plus Retinol Triple Correction Eye Serum. And I did order a full size of these with something else because it was the same price as just getting this one. This stuff is expensive. Um, I like this eye serum because eye creams you can only put under your eyes. This serum you can put under your eyes and up here. And as you guys know, if you've watched my other videos, that I did talk about I have like this extra skin up here so I have slightly hooded eyes and then I have like all this extra skin and this is supposed to help tighten the skin and on his website they do have 
it's not a video, but it's a picture. And you can slide it to like before and after and see the difference. And the pictures look good, but that was only one person. So I don't really know if that's going to help up here. This, my skin tolerates really well. And I've been able to stop using um, the Bashia charcoal gel that I was using under my eyes. And so I am having a good um, effect to under there. And I do feel like it's helping with my double bags not looking as baggy and my wrinkles do seem to be um, minimizing. So this you can use day and night, which I have been using day and night. Um, there was a sample of um, his C plus collagen brighten and firm vitamin C serum. This stuff, I just cannot get past the smell. Um, and you use it, I believe, once a day. Yeah, once daily. Uh, I am going to use it up, but I will not repurchase it. I like the Peter Thomas Roth one a lot better. And this one you can use twice a day. This leaves my skin feeling sticky. No matter how little I use. And I, I, the smell, I just, I, I just don't care for it to, enough to purchase it. So I'm glad that. It came in a kit, and as a gift, they had sent another one. So the one I didn't even open, I'm going to give that away. And what else? And then the kit that I ordered, I think it was called the Power Up Kit. I will look for the link and post it below. For the price, I like being able to try different products. Um, this is his C Plus Collagen Deep Cream, and you can use it twice a day, but I only use it at night sometimes because during the day, I don't have a separate SPF. And I am still using the Olay Regenerous Whip with sunscreen, broad spectrum, SPF 25. And so this is how I get my sunscreen. And so when I use this, I only use it at night. Otherwise, I would end up using this cream and then putting another moisturizer on top of it, which I feel is kind of a waste. And because I sweat a lot, that would just be too much um, cream on my face. This is not even particularly moisturizing. So even though it says it's a cream, I don't know if it's supposed to be a moisturizer. I don't know. But my skin does like it. It's just like, do I need it if I'm going to just put other stuff on top of it? And also because I am putting um, a vitamin C serum on anyway. So do I need a vitamin C um, cream? But it does have collagen in it too. So I'm just kind of like, eh, I did not order a full size of one of these. Another thing that she did recommend is his Ferolic Plus Retinol Wrinkle Recovery Overnight Serum. Um, my skin likes it. Uh, I did not purchase a full size one. Um, and my reason, my reason being is, is I'm using the eye serum for my under eye and for up here. And I'm using the retinol 24 Olay Regenerate Serum at night. So I'm like, do I need another retinol? Even though this has folic acid in it. So, I am going to use it to use it up, but I'm not going to purchase that one. Also at night, um, after as serums, because I do have quite a few, <laughs> I've been using the Olay Re Regenerous Retinol 24 Night Moisturizer. These are fragrance-free. Another thing I like about Olay is they have a lot of fragrance-free products, which is why I do believe that my skin tolerates them very well. And so those are the products that I'm rotating through. Depending on how my skin feels after my serums in the morning, if my skin is excessively dry when I get up in the morning or the afternoon because I go to sleep in the morning and so I get up in the afternoon. <laughs> if my skin is feeling drier than usual, I will still use the Bashia um, Sabaki Beauty Oil. And also depending on how my skin is feeling, I may or may not still use the Olay Regenerous regenerating serum so those are all of the skincare products that i am rotating day and night and or depending on what my skin is telling me that it needs and so i hope this was helpful um i will remember to list this stuff down below i'm looking at it like that's a lot of stuff <laughs> And so I don't have a strict routine like this is what I do during the day. This is what I do during the night. It just depends on what my skin is telling me it needs. And then I base it off of that. But I do like having a variety. So the main 
brands that I am using right now is the Peter Thomas Roth, um, Dr. Dennis Gross, and my all-time favorite from probably, yeah, 30 years ago, because I'm 50 now and I've been using it since my 20, 20s, is Olay. And so those are the three main products that I'm using right now. And my skin is happy. It's red right now because I did do the steamer today and then I did this pill. And this, this pill does make my face red. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, leave them below. If you've tried any of these products, um, let me know how they work for you or if they didn't work for you with your opinion of them is and also do check out the Olay website their products are a fraction of the cost of Peter's and Dennis's <laughs> brand so I suggest if there's something that you're needing if you're wanting a vitamin C if you're wanting vitamin B if you're wanting a serum if you're wanting something fragrance free if you're wanting retinol I suggest um, going to the Olay, Olay website and sign up because then they'll send you coupons and things like that and at the time of this video, they had 25% off site wide for like the last week and a half. And so if you can get, you know, a good deal um, for the Olay products, I would suggest doing that. If you want to splurge, which is Dennis and Peter stuff, go for it. <laughs> Especially on the Rogue Cell. So, you know, I'm going to try and go ahead and upload these in case you do want to splurge on some of his products. I do recommend reading the reviews on the Sephora site before plunging in, um, but also you can return it if it doesn't work. So, but still spend wisely because the stimulus check is not gonna pay for everything. So, you know, don't just spend just because it's extra because money's never extra, it always goes somewhere. So anyway, thank you for watching. And I know this was two long videos in a row. I appreciate you being here and you will see me I'm sorry, I was looking at this steamer. I thought it was cracked, but it's not. I'm like, this better not be cracked. I just got it. Um, sorry. <laughs> Welcome to the crazy. See me in the next video. Thanks, guys. Bye.